Now let's start with Mac OS installation. There's another additional installation video specially made for all the Windows users. So in the video descriptions, you will find a timestamp for easy navigation. So feel free to use it to navigate through the videos. Okay, now let's start with navigating to personas.com using your browser. So once you've reached there, go to software and studio one, of course. Right, so Studio One, you will see the creativity begins here. When you scroll down, go to try the demo, okay? Click on that. And it will ask you to sign up if you have not gotten any account with Presonus. Just put in your email, password, check on the capture, recapture, and read the agreement and get the demo. For me, I have already done it, so I can simply log in and we can download the installation file. Okay, so over here you will see Studio One 6 demo. Now then you will have the download installer Mac. Click and download it. I'm going to install it um, on my download folder. All right, so let's just let it run. Now, if you scroll below, you will find some release note, demos and tutorials. You can download it, uh, manual as well. But don't worry, when you install the Presonus, when you launch the applications, they will actually ask you to download as well. Okay, so, okay, I think it's done. So let's just navigate and to my download folder, double click on the installer see this all right so what you need to do is just as usual as how you install other software in the Mac as well since so drag and drop it into the application file okay so it will just ding, ding, done already so let's go to my personas where's my personas yes it's over here okay so just launch it now the moment you launch it it will ask you a few things and uh, it's an app download from internet. Are you sure you want to open it? Yes, click on open. Activating products. Okay, so this is an important step. Okay, it's an important step. So you will see this Studio One, whether you want to activate Presonus Sphere, which is their subscriptions uh, models, but we want to install Prime for free. So just go to the last selections Run Studio One Prime, the feature limited free version. And that's it. Activate Studio One Prime. Select and they are done. Thank you. Studio One has been activated on this computer. Select OK. So now it will run through a few scripts. But you can see from here, this is Studio One Prime. OK. Of course, there's another option where they allow you to trial uh, for the full professional versions if you want to no problem now next thing that comes up pops up it will be this act, available downloads so these are the things that you will like you will need to download if you want to run on the uh, library etc so you can just put it there um, uh, select everything others uh, library all this I uh, usually will check uh, in terms of documents, you probably just need the manual in English unless you want to have French or Japanese, whatever you can download. Okay, so once it's done, just install five items and that's it. So it will initiate the downloads. Okay, now um, in the next sessions, um, so before we go into that, you will see these are the files that you are downloading. Okay, now scan sessions, we will talk about the interface as well. All right, so that is for the Mac. So let's move on to the Windows. All right. Windows installations is pretty much the same like Mac. So first thing we need to do is to navigate to presonus.com. So after that, of course, then you will go to the menu bar, go to software, Studio One. So similarly, scroll down where you will see the try the demo button, select 
and come to this page. So same thing, if you have not signed up previously, do the sign up. And if you have already done the sign up, like what I did, what I need to do is just enter my email and password and I can just log in. Right, so they will automatically detect your um, OS. So in this case, uh, installer will be on the Windows. Okay, so I've already downloaded previously, so I can just navigate over and run the installer for Presonus Studio 1 6. So, same thing, you will just go through the normal installations like what you do for other Windows applications as well. So, just give some time for the program to run through, and it's actually pretty fast if you have good uh, RAMs. So, finish and you can just go and launch the Presonus so in the search bar then reason you will see Studio 1.6 so this is the part where it's important okay after you have accept the uh, the terms and conditions you need to log in so what you need to do is just log in using your um, emails and also password Right, so you will come to the same thing. So this demo has ended, and this is the page where you need to select Run Studio One Prime. Okay, you can of course choose whether you want to do a full versions uh, demo period or not. But in this case, we just want to run Studio One Prime for the free version. Okay, so select and click on Activate Studio One Prime. Yes, thank you. You your Studio One has been activated. And from here, same thing, you will see Studio One Prime. So similarly, it will just run through the whole bunch of scripts and then prompt you to download all the installer. Okay, so same, you will just install all the items if you want to. Uh, of course, uh, the in terms of the documents, you just need the English, all right? slightly different actually so if you see from here uh, compare with the what the one that we just did for the Mac okay so there are quite a number of things maybe a little different in terms of the, the views and the UIs but pretty much the rest of all the libraries the sound the samples these are all the same okay now so this is the download for studio one prime okay so here for windows you can just navigate but we will talk a little bit more in details okay now so um i think that's about it for now we will catch up soon all right see you bye bye